high in altitude. Um, here at uh, Tremolin and um, uh, in the UB area. Um, all right, Milestone 3, we started integrating our array of six antennas connected to a laptop. What we had was we had a laptop, which was connected to USB to a USB controlled switch, which was connected to six antennas. The switch would send the signal from one of the antennas at a time to our laptop. We wrote some code that would go through and would sweep through the antennas and find the one with the highest signal strength. And then it would switch and look to the antenna to the left. It would look to the antenna to the right. And then it would compare the signals of the antennas and choose the one that had the best signal strength. And we would continue to do that so that it could track an object <coughs> that was moving in a path in front of the antennas. Um, once we wrote the code for our tracking signal, we also decided to build an LED circuit right here. Well, once we build the antenna array, which is uh, right here, this is uh, the suite. <coughs> We used two poles between six to seven feet tall. We split the dimensions. We put out the uh, six antennas on each pole between 15 degrees of difference between each antenna uh, from zero to 90 degrees. We built also an LED circuit where we're able to connect it to the antenna and run the program. Once we connect this LED circuit, uh, we have different six different lights, and each of the lights was able to uh, LED, each LED will turn on depending on the signal strain. So whichever had the strongest signal will be the LED that was uh, basically the light up. Uh, 